Hi and hello everyone and welcome back to our Icewind Dale Enhanced Edition multiplayer series featuring myself, Berg77, and Great Hunter. Say hello. Hello. Oh, not the rattle of your drink. Yes, uh, the ice <laughs> rattles. The ice rattle. Uh, okay, cool. So we are heading back to that, um, right. that place where that big giant was. Oh, oh they hey, followed they followed. Us, that's that's yeah. cheating. I, I don't approve. Okay, I need to run these guys back. Yeah, I'm thinking that we should stay back a bit. Hang on while I just put the scripts back on for people. Well, I don't mind sending Dwarf Shanks in. It's just I want to run Berg and... Uh, yeah, no, of course. We don't want to right, put ready? the squishy people up front. Uh, just give us one second. She has no script. She should have a script. No, not colors. Script. Actually, no, she's okay. All right, good to go. Give the word. Mine. You know what I'm thinking, though? I'm thinking we need some flames. Get your fire on. Are you bringing the fire elemental out? Right, Damn okay. straight I am. Crunch. Something amiss? Now, hopefully he will just, like, set the trolls on fire when they fall. Yeah, Actually. I'm going to take care of the one that's on the ground just because he might take his time getting there. Yeah. Greater ice troll my ass. Yeah, he's killing them by hitting them. Good stuff. I like this fella. He does good work. Now you <laughs> stop it. <clears throat> they make really weird noises. I'm here. Jamie's gonna leave us now. He's not gonna yeah, follow us through this. I'm kind of disappointed by that. I wish you could just like call him back and be like, "Hey, by the way, I'm I don't need you to help us Get anymore." Right. Yeah. All right, let's go. He did pretty well. Though. It's funny. He kind of looks more like he should be like an earth elemental. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, like I can see slightly. the whole fire kind of thing because he's got all the bright orangey spots. But yeah, I agree. He's more like an earth kind of looking guy. Well, in like Heroes of Might and Magic and stuff like that, that would be like an Earth Elemental because they always look kind of lavery because mm. they're like magma, like they're from the core of the Earth or something like that. But um, like Fire Elemental should be like just a flame type person. Yeah, I was thinking they look more like um, uh, like like just basically a living flame kind of thing, you know? Yeah, yeah, like the Human Torch. Yeah, yeah, like that. How strange. I can't believe they follow us all the way. It'd be funny if they follow us to Kaldahar. <laughs> That's Just a lot of effort. us. Tracked us for days. Like, yeah, oh, we'll get you. They did that whole Lord of the Rings, the Two Towers thing, where they just followed them. Man flesh. Yes. <laughs> what do you smell? Ain't had nothing but maggoty bread for three stinking days. Oh, God. <laughs> On my way. I don't know why the bread went maggoty. I don't think maggots necessarily eat I know, but it would have gone moldy. I don't think it would have necessarily gone maggoty. Maybe you underestimate orc bread. I don't know, man. I've only ever seen maggots appear on, like, flesh. Maybe, really maybe when they but... say bread, I... they don't mean bread bread. I I'm not saying it can't happen. Like, I'm not, like, making a statement like, maggots <laughs> will not eat bread. I'm, I'm just saying that, like... <laughs> I've never encountered it. Like, you know, I've never seen, like, moldy bread with maggots on it. I've only ever seen, like, moldy bread with mold on it. Like, you know? But I have seen, like, spoiled meat that's got maggots on it. Make way. All right, let's go into this little tunnel now because there shouldn't be that many of them in yeah, there. Yeah, you, you still said that there wasn't that many people in there, so shall we? You'll see what I mean when you come oh, in hello. here. Oh, Yes, I see something. So it, it was quite a confined space if we had fought them in there. Yeah. You know? But now yeah, I wouldn't have come to fight in here. Do you think it's worth right. throwing down another fire element? No, 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 not at all, not at all. I'll uh, flame arrow him. Oh, there is another one. Adria, go and stab that one. Am I yeah, really out of keep arrows? Him. I just am out of arrows. Busy. Don't worry, I'll throw you some in a second. No, no, I, I have more. I just um, not in the quiver. You know what? She still has that fire dagger, so she should probably use that. <laughs> oh, it's alright. They're dead anyway. They're dead. Speaking of arrows, I actually might need to get out some more myself anyway. Shit, we're only we're down to like 685 arrows in reserve. 
Hmm. A little bit concerned. Maybe, Maybe we, we need to make some... a little trip back to Kaldahar. Yeah, well, I mean, we're not, we're, not in dire need. we're not in dire need just yet, but, like, it's something that... We'll yeah, no, I mean, like, after we've cleared out this and this entire cave, just, you know, quickly pop back to Kaldahar, then you, pop you back again. some more or have you got some? Like, no, I'm good. Hand. I'm good for now. Good. So what does the map say about this? Does it say anything? Oh, okay, so, yeah, we are still in the same... Like cave system as we were before. Oh, there's like to, to some barracks that go through here. Where, where's that entrance? It says like to a barracks. I don't know. Shall we explore? There, there's got to be more baddies in here. There. Oh, yeah, found them. <laughs> and so did you, apparently. Maybe, maybe we will need that fire elemental actually, because I'm going to run out of spells to deal with these guys. Okay, well I'll call him up. Uh, fire elemental. Oops, that's the wrong button. Nope. Some level up. Fire Elemental, we need you. I was going to say, you can just summon him? Yeah, yeah, I was just waiting a second. So I made sure that uh, I wasn't going to get interrupted while casting it, because that would be unfortunate if I went to all that effort of casting it, and then, you know, they just blocked it. Are you not going to... Oh, is he not going to fucking attack the ones that are already down? I can control him, so oh, there I'll make is, him. There is. Yeah. <laughs> I was leaving him to do his own thing for a minute, but apparently he's not quite intelligent enough to figure out which <laughs> thing to attack. There's still one more down on the ground. You might want to turn him around. There we go. Now, lads, stop wasting your word. arrows. <laughs> okay, does this lead up the other side? Like, oh yeah, these both lead to the same place. All right, let's just clear what out. Is, right. What is this skeleton thing? That's what I'm curious about. It's like a big dragon. A big worm. I've never hmm. quite understood the difference. Like, are worms just like baby dragons, or are they like something completely different? I have no idea. I think idea. they are something completely different. Oh, a yeti! Something wrong. Oh, and there's like some yes. dude down here as well. Black Ice is his name. Black Ice Knight. Time to turn this that sounds interesting. He's not doing it. He's just standing there. But... Maybe he's not, you know, like immediately hostile to us, and he's just waiting for his moment. <laughs> He's just waiting for us to annoy him. Man, we're steaming through these idiots. Well, they are yetis. Let's let's be it's honest. True. These guys were kind yetis of yetis weren't even really that scary back in the day. Yeah, they were outclassed when we first encountered them. Uh, let's just keep exploring here before we go and speak, because I don't think there's too much more. Either. Yeah, there's another yeti, and then another exit, another little tunnel. Oh, so this is the barracks, I'm presuming. Not that, that little thing that was on the map isn't like an exit to the barracks. It actually is the barracks, I'm presuming. Yeah, maybe. I, I can't see the barracks thing that you're talking about, but... Oh! Oh, hello. What's that? Contic. I don't know if Contic's a man or a woman. <laughs> I don't know. Voice what you feel. So, at last we meet. I am Contic, and I greet you. You were expecting me? Us? Oh, yes. Who your coming was foretold to me. I have been waiting for your arrival. Okay, foretold by whom? The goddess! She cast her gaze into the future and saw our paths cross here. Thus, she bid me to journey here, to await your coming. I got a bad feeling about what this goddess wants him to do, or, you know. Plus, this guy seems a bit cocksure, isn't Yeah, who's, who's this goddess you speak of? Why? Aurel! Of course she is. She welcomes you. Right. And the Frost Maiden, so so what does what does she want? I have a bad feeling about this, by the way. To chill to the chill of her embrace, the cold of her bosom, and to the black ice of her frozen heart, she has prepared a place of honor for the bastards who slew her chosen Lysan. Mm -hmm. you could slay a child of Aral and not feel her wrath? Die, wretched fools! Die that Aral will may feast on your souls. Well, I guess this response is basically just a no you, so no, you die. <laughs> no, your mum. <laughs> yeah, your <laughs> mum, bitch. Alright, you ready? Ooh. Yeah. Um, I'm guessing that these black knights are going to be hostile. How many are there? I can only see one. There's two. There's two. There's one, like, in the ribcage. Oh, right, okay. He's kind of outside with us. Alright, well, uh, yeah. Go for it. I'm hoping. Oh, no, I'm just pausing. I'm hoping that uh, this flame. 
I think it's a woman contact, by the way, just yeah, maybe. listening to her casting spells, but it doesn't matter. I'm hoping that how these I black how ice knights... To know that it's a woman? Well, that's why I said either. I, I don't... I can't tell. All right, you ready? Yep. I'm thinking that the fire elemental might have an advantage against her if she's the whole frost maiden thing. So right, I don't well, know if you I'm, want to use Shmendwams. I've got my people firing at her to maybe cancel out whatever spell she's casting. Yep. Yes. Uh, this one's mine. What you want? Consider it done. All right. All right, there's more. Let's see if we can't get him in choke point. Shmendwam is getting Shmendwan. smacked. He should retreat. Yeah, I, I thought he might be able to survive longer, but I was wrong. How much damage to- whoa, there's like only a slight injury on one of the knights. Stop, hold on. That's it, that's it, he stopped chasing me. There we go, near death. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, um, oh no, Dwarf Shank's leveled up. Yeah, yeah, is she dead? She is dead. What's this fucking, like, shit falling around? Oh wow, she dropped some awesome stuff! Well, I say awesome stuff, she dropped a ton of stuff that needs identifying. Well, um, Dwarf Shanks, maybe leave this area. Yeah, Dwarf Shanks should probably get the hell out of there. Whoa, what what the hell is happening to Lady Grey? She just suddenly got hit with, like, a bunch of damage. I don't know, but we're alright. We'll, we'll deal with these. Okay. Yeah, they, they don't seem to be all that bad. They're annoying. I mean, no, they're, they're fairly tough. But, like, you know, they're not... Yeah, but they're, they're not, not, not really killing us. They just seem kind of irritating. Yeah. Oh, that was a waste of my chromatic lord. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So did you pick up the stuff from... Um... I didn't pick up anything, so we'll do that in a second. Let's just uh, fire some heals down. <laughs> yep. Heals are probably a good idea. What do we got in the way of healing? Oh, and Dwarf Shank's leveled up. Yay! I'm aware. Let's go level him up. Ooh, cool. Okay, so I get three extra spells, one level one, one level two, and one level five. That's pretty good. That's quite a lot of spells. I like that. All right, for level one, I haven't used Bless in ages. I might as well just give him another Cure <laughs> Light Wounds. Uh, for level two, uh, I haven't used Silence either in ages, but uh, I'll give him another Cure Moderate Wounds. And for level five, oh, he hasn't had a level five yet, and I've now got raised dead. That's that's, that's really crucial. Yeah, that's the one. Um, there's some other really cool spells here actually, but it's raised dead. And then the next time we get one, we'll be able to. Uh... Actually, well, I actually, does he need to? Are. No, does he need to carry raised dead with him? He doesn't need to have it on him because basically what we can do is when someone dies, I can always flip it out. We can rest. And yeah. then he, you know what I mean. So actually, that's not worth yeah. him actually carrying. I wouldn't it put him. it on him now, but I think it's really yeah. really useful. Oh, no, 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 it's super good that he's got it, but it's like something that we don't actually need now. What should I actually give him? Mass Cure Light Wounds. That's not half bad as like a... No, that's not half bad. Just throwing I mean, it's only Light spell. Wounds. Shield of Lathlander. Uh, immunity damage for the duration of the spell. Evil creatures cannot be protected. The spell cannot be cut. All right, so he's immune for two rounds. That's handy. And he can attack as well, I'm guessing. It's not like one of those ones where you can... You know what I mean, where like they can't do anything. Yeah, it doesn't seem to have one of those caveats where it's like, by the way, you can't do this, this, or this. Yeah. It's got flame strike, which is pretty good, but um Watch this. Yeah, it seems handy. Uh, champion strength. Mm. Uh he does have cure critical wounds as well. I don't While know. you're Maybe dealing I'll... with that, I'm gonna send Adria to go pick up all this stuff and then hand it over to Shmendwan. Yeah. I'm just thinking what to uh use here. Maybe flame strike. I don't know. No, I'll give him cure critical wounds, and then we'll give him something else afterwards. Um, there's a couple of scrolls here. Do you want to grab them? Just, just yeah. I'll, I'm going to come down. There's nothing else actually. Oh, there is something. There's like a little cubby. There's like a little hole there. Yeah. Have you got into that? Is that what you're talking about? Yeah, that, that's what I was talking about. There's um scrolls and potions in that one. If you want to look. Yeah. Uh, did you bring Schmendwan down here or not? Yeah, he should be down there. Yeah, he is. Okay, because I'm going to pass all this stuff off to him Potion for identification. Regeneration. Potion regeneration is good. There's some robes here which might be decent for him. <coughs> I don't know. 
Potion of Stone Form Dunk. <laughs> and Potion of Storm Giant Strength. Not care. Uh, there was shield. also a barrel of pure water. This barrel contains some of the purest water in the land. Melted from ice, it contains no impurities that would be found in normal sources of water. Interesting. I'm guessing this is for that uh, that elf person who said that they want to restore the Arborium? I can't remember what it was. Oh, Chain Lightning. Awesome. Ch -ch chain Lightnings. Where is Chain Lightning? What level is that? Oh, it's level 6. I can't get any level 6 spells yet. I can't use them. But that will certainly be the spell that gets used hmm. when I do get that slot. Uh, let's see if I can identify any of this. The, one of the rings I can't. One of the short sword. The short sword I can't. The other ring I can't. The robe I can't. And oh, breath of arrow. It's a what is it? I don't even know what it is. It's a dagger. Oh, ah. right, okay. It gives you plus one intelligence with minus one charisma, hmm. minus fifty percent fire resistance, plus one hundred percent cold resistance. Uh, can only be removed by remove curse. So once you've equipped it, give the word. Uh, you yeah, can cast curse bolt twice per day. It's actually a good dagger, but like the only person who would be using it is Berg, and I want to keep his charisma as high as possible. Yeah, and I don't care about his intelligence. So. Um, do we want to head back down towards that uh, that other Come exit? By the way. Yeah, hold on. The robe is the robe of the evil Ark Magi. It. Makes the armor class 5, saving throw, plus 1, magic resistance 5%. That's not really that great, I don't think. Yeah, oh, I can't even I'd... use it. Why not? Who's can you... Oh, can... Cannot be used by anyone good or neutral. It has to be used by someone evil, that's why. Oh. Well, that kind of makes sense, I guess. All right, and there's two rings here which we would have to rest or heal to... Um... Well, we can always identify them later, I guess. We don't need them right this second, unless you want to. Yeah, I mean, to they could... Well, you them. never know. They could be awesome, but like, I'm yeah, not really that... They could close. be. No, we're alright. We'll, we'll just move on. I just think that we should probably, you know, like, explore the entire place, find mm -hmm. out about this Craig guy. What do you want, right? And there's also those uh, those altars and whatever that were in the. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, what Let's does it say? Let's go to the altar first before we. This speak shrine to the, is constructed uh... of human skulls. The body of a dead woman is draped across it. Well, that's charming. That's that's very cheery. I'm just going to detect a trap. Don't speak to the giant yet. We'll talk to yeah, him. Yeah, who in a is he? He's a frost giant guard, so he's not the guy he we looks, get to see. He looks way cooler than what the um, what were those dudes? You know those other giant guys that we encountered once upon a time. The Etons. Yeah, they look like. Yeah, this monks. guy looks like someone just took him out of Norse mythology. Yeah, basically. except he's got okay. horns on the helmet, and we all know that Vikings didn't actually have those horns. Wow, hold on one second. Potion of Power. Oh, this powerful really elixir done. is similar to Potion of Heroism in that it effectively raises the endurance level. <laughs> okay, so it sets the FACO to 80% of current base. It increases your hit points by 20%. Moves silently by 20%. And, uh, it's kind of cool, but like I don't ever really see when I'm going to use it. Oh, hey, I found some cool stuff. I found a, uh, a longbow, I think. A... Where did you find it? Uh, over on those other piles of stuff. Oh, was there other piles of stuff? I didn't yeah. know. Yeah. Uh, a thing of plate armor. A yeah, loose. there's just a regular ninjato. I, like, I can just dump that, right? We don't need that. Yeah, we, we don't need that. <laughs> um, are these rings actually decent, or are they just for selling? There's a, a gold ring, a ring of um, fire opals, apparently, and a set of broken armor. Do we care? Uh, I don't know. The take take the like the ring like if it's just the ring and stuff like we take it. There's no reason not to take it. They're not heavy. I can put them in the ring bag. Yeah, there's also a bunch of jewels that are over here that I'm gonna grab. Uh, ring of holiness. Uh, equipped can cast one extra priest level spell for each level from one to four. Wow, that's awesome. That's pretty good. Dwarf Shanks does have a ring on him, the ring of sanctuary, but he. Never uses it, but he's got a spare slot as well for another ring, so we'll certainly give that to him and I'll add his spells in a second. That's awesome. Okay, um, who has the uh, the bag of rings and stuff, by the way? Uh, Berg. Alright, I'm passing stuff over to you. Ah, right, some certainly cool stuff we found in here. I wonder how cool these other rings and these gauntlets that I couldn't identify are. 
What's this thing? <coughs> okay, this is a longbow of some kind that I found. Do you want to um, do a bit of resting? I, th I, I think it's worth it, because, I mean, we found some pretty cool stuff, it looks like. Yeah. All right, hold on. Now I'm just adding everything to... Yeah. Are you done giving me stuff? No, you still no I've got to. one more thing to pass over to Berg. And then uh, Schmendwan can hold on to this armor. And this bow. And this loot, I'm guessing it is. Loot. Yeah, there's, there's a bard instrument that I've just handed mm. over to him. Which I know we're never going to use, but it might be worth selling or holding on to. Uh, I'm going to give another animate dead here and then another heal. Not level And level four, defensive harmony is pretty good. Lesser restoration. What's lesser restoration? Life energy recipient is raised. Reverse. All right, okay, doesn't matter. Uh, I don't want to spend too much time looking at this. Uh, well, we can always end the episode here. You decide what you want to do and then we'll come back um, with your choices. Sorry, yeah, I'm, I'm being a bit... No, sorry, I've, I've, I've done what I wanted. Well, we're at about right. time anyway. So. Yeah, yeah, cool. All right, so we'll end the episode here. Um, we'll do a bit of identifying off camera, and then we'll tell you what we found, and then we'll go and speak to the giant, and we'll see you next time. All right, bye. Mm -hmm.